So this gonna be a, hold on real quick. I only got this much candle left. So it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a nice little something. But yeah, so like I was saying, y'all, <clears throat> like I was saying, I told y'all what I am. This is not a game, this is not an act, this is not to be funny. This is not to fight the Illuminati. This is not to fight against the government. I'm not here because of the government. I'm here because there's simply a time where the real angels is about to wake up. Like, yeah, the real Neos in the Matrix is about to wake up. So I'm not here to fight. The war that I'm already fighting in if you want to consider it a spiritual war, we already won. This side, see the way time works, <clears throat> that's why y'all better figure it out and hurry up and get right and get loyal with God. Be loyal to him. That's said, He's merciless. He ain't going to give a fuck about the way you feel. You know what I'm saying? Understand that this life that you're living right now, It's not, it's not life, it's death. And that's why this video today, cause see y'all be thinking this shit is a game because my, my spiritual, this is not religion. This is real life. This shit is not shit that you play with like this type of shit right here see some of these people that's in these little illuminati groups dying at certain ages on purpose see they know where they going in life see if you know where you going after this i always try to tell you if you know where you going then you'll be able to see that's why i'm trying to tell you today this video is called seeing the light because that shit is fake you don't see no light after you die. You just straight up go to a whole different world. That's it. It's not going to be a light you see. You know what the light people be seeing? That's the reincarnation light. That's the light for people who don't know where they're going after this. That's what I'm trying to tell you. See, angels, we know where we're going after this. We're not worried about it. We're going to live to see it all. Because when you're fighting on God's side, the battle can't be lost. Because this battle goes beyond this physical shit y'all think y'all looking at. It's nothing to me. This, this physical world is nothing to me. You know why? Because it's not about fuck cleaning my system out for years. I never had certain shit in my system. You get it? Like I never really was a person who ate meat. So I'm gonna see everything totally different. I'm fully functional. I'm more functional than probably 99% of y'all. Because being functional is about what you wanna do. Like me, I don't wanna do nothing but do music, so if I'm doing music and I'm progressing and feeling successful, then I'm happy. That's what I'm saying. Y'all, some of y'all could be rich and y'all never be happy. But it's the same thing for an angel too, because we already rich and we can't be happy. You know why? Because we gotta see all y'all suffer. That's what I'm saying. So I'm not here to battle with everybody that's Illuminati or everybody that's part of the government. No. I don't have no enemies. I don't have none. I don't worry about other people. I don't worry about other companies. If it ain't me and my own company, I really don't worry about it. Like I said, in life, you got a choice. You dying anyway, so you might as well just be happy. You know what I'm saying? Because in life, you, you have no choice. Like, you really have no choice. You got to just you either go along with everything or, you know what I'm saying, you get rolled over by it. So, like I said, so that was to start that off like that. 
So seeing a light is fake. It is. It's fake. It's something for lost people when they die. Yeah. So it, it really does happen after you die. But that's because, you get it? That's what you booted into your program. You must learn and understand that you're a cyborg in this holographic universe. Yeah, atoms and all of that shit. No, they don't exist. They don't. They don't. Because if they keep splitting it down and splitting it down, it won't be there no more. So that's simple shit. So that's what I'm trying to tell you. So don't worry about all of this shit. That's all a program. That was just something you were supposed to hear growing up, seeing a light. Yeah, people see that shit in their dreams. <clears throat> but the world after this, it ain't... You don't have to worry about... You don't have to even worry about seeing. That's what I'm trying to tell you. So, all that other shit is stupid. So, like I said, that video on ayahuasca is going to come up. I'm going to bring that up. And I got another video that I'm going to do on what I eat. And like I said... It's a short list of shit because me, I've never drunk Coca-Cola in my life. I probably tasted it one time. Y'all ate McDonald's this year. I haven't ate McDonald's in probably almost my whole life. That's what I'm trying to tell you. I was probably, oh uh, man, I, I barely, I can't even remember. That's what I'm saying. So. That's why my skin is clear. I look healthy. I look clean. I don't have to even work out to have an eight pack. I don't have to do none of that shit. All I got to do is sit here and make music and I'm going to look good regardless. So that's what I'm trying to tell y'all. So y'all got to just take care of your body and your mind because it's not even there. So if it's not there, you see, once you stop, the eating and shit. See, because the soda, the eating meat, all of that got to go. To become an angel, you have to change your diet. I'm talking about some of y'all not going to be able to eat meat for ever again. That's what I'm saying. See, me, I don't even think about, oh, I might have to eat it or uh, no. I just, I, like, meat is not even on my mind. So that means with this earth, I'm doing this earth a great deal of justice by me alone just being a vegan because that's promising the earth that I will never kill an animal or have to eat an animal you get it but all of y'all are eating animals <laughs> that's not good y'all are eating more fucking animals than animals on this motherfucking earth Seriously, that's why they gotta feed y'all fake meat. Cause they gotta keep y'all motherfuckers happy. And guess what? When it comes to America, y'all niggas is the ones that everybody's trying to keep happy. Yeah, all the all you comers over here, all the chopped up animals come over here. Yeah. Fish from China. Y'all gotta wake the fuck up. I don't know. I just fin yo, listen, I just finished my mixtape. Like, I'm serious. I've been, I've been working. I'm about to... I wanted to finish my mixtape by Valentine's Day. I got that accomplished. I'm only giving you niggas, like, eight songs a mixtape now. Because I used to throw out mixtapes on the street. 20 songs, 18 That's too long. That really is. My song's only like a fucking minute and a half nowadays, so I'm only gonna give y'all whatever the fuck. Y'all, y'all can't. Y'all attentions. Y'all eat so much meat. Y'all attention span is short. That shit is short. Y'all only need about a minute and a half song. Cause by the time they get to the third minute, y'all ain't even listening no more. But that's what I'm saying. So understand and learn to learn life. Y'all probably think it's funny, oh, he wearing his, his head like an octopus. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's what that's what y'all gonna see out this whole video. Instead of understanding about 
seeing the light is fake. Because you're going to have people who say they died and shit like that. And seeing a light, that's what they taught demons so they could uh, feel comfortable about the other side. But real angels, angels like this, like me, like, because I'm not the only nigga that's an angel. Half these niggas that's like me is not going to say nothing on YouTube. They're not going to say nothing. Y'all don't get it. I'm really fucking Superman around this bitch. I really am. Not because I want to be. That's because some of us is chosen. We have to do this shit. Like, God is... It ain't nobody else that's going to do it. Who else going to do it? Because I would do it even if I wasn't doing music or had anything else that I was doing that was... I would still be wanting to do this. That's what I'm saying. Like, this shit is not something that, oh, I got to struggle, get on here, make money. Nigga, I could literally be on here all day talking spiritual because this is a lifestyle that niggas live. Niggas didn't eat meat over 20 years. That's what I'm talking about. So when y'all niggas ain't eat meat for 10 years, because... I know you got to have your money right to eat the way you want to eat because when you first click over to being a vegan, everything is expensive. But when you get to be like me and be a person who just try to go as long as you can without eating every fucking day. And that's how you get strong. You're going to get strong. I don't care what the fuck all these other people tell you on their page. I don't care how many weights they lifting. Nigga. When I tell you, you get stronger, you get strong. I probably could, I probably could not eat for 10 days straight if I want to. Like real shit, I'm built like that. Like if all of this shit went out, the power, everything, and y'all niggas couldn't eat, I will be the nigga standing. Y'all niggas would be on the floor about two hours. Two hours after not having no food, y'all niggas would be on the floor crying, talking about y'all got cramps. I be standing up, walking around, sipping on some Fiji, like I do all the time. Cause more, more or less, an angel really pretty much only feel like they need water. Like I don't, I don't feel like I be needing food at all. Like that's an angel's diet, Fiji, or water from Iceland. That's it. It ain't really too much shit on here to eat for for angel. Because when you got that angel inside of you, it won't even come out if you're eating shit like death. Nothing I eat is dead. I don't even have to have it. Nigga, I don't even order vegan shit from fast food plates. I don't even order salads. That's what I'm trying to tell y'all. Y'all got to understand everything got energy on it. Even a windy salad. It could be bright, fresh and green, juicy, crunchy, fresh. Right out the motherfucking garden. But if it's coming from Wendy's, I don't want it. Because it's coming from there. Do you get it? I don't give a fuck if it's an organic real salad. I don't want it from Wendy's. I don't want it from none of these fucking places. Because when you're walking around like this and you're walking around and you're looking around and you like me and you're an angel. <clears throat> you don't want to eat nothing. Everything look like a fucking piece of poison. Trying to tell you. Now me, I'm the only nigga you're going to get true light from. That's it. Everybody else is fake. Everybody. Niggas dealing with astrology, they don't even, they so stupid, they don't even fucking realize they in a program. I told you. There's God, and then there's messengers for God. And I'm not talking about these niggas, T.D. Jakes, and all these motherfucking fake pastors you see in the church taking everybody bread. I'm not talking about them. I'm not talking about the pimps. 
of the fucking sanctuary, motherfucker. I'm talking about where the pastors at that give you money, motherfucker. That's what I want. Where's that, pastor? Because I'm going to come right to the church and wait for y'all niggas to put something in my fucking hand. Like I said, if you want to help people in this world, go help people on your own. Like me. You're going to... I'm going to have... I don't even want to say it like that, but I'm going to have shit for... I'm going to have a lot of help out there for like... Homeless people and people that need to be in a shelter. People that like... You get what I'm saying? Like, I'm going to do something with money I make to help other people because I don't give a fuck about money. So even when I'm rich, I'll be just doing shit for other people all the time. I'm satisfied because I'm always happy. Just knowing that, see, y'all, when y'all die, y'all ain't going to get to do nothing else after this. See me? I get to live this again and over and not, I don't have to be here when I live it. You got to understand, there's a bigger projection of this shit that's going on. Just a little version of it. I could play the big boy version of it. So, like I said, the spiritual shit is real. Don't ever eat meat again a day in your life. Real shit. Now. Now I'm now people are now people are calling me a spiritual leader now. I guess that's what I am. I'm really not a spiritual leader because a spiritual leader is not supposed to follow nobody else. I follow God, the real one. Cause I like me, I'm not yeah, when you die, you gonna be God again. But that's after you die. So you kind of got to like show your respect while you here. Because if you don't, he'll clip your ass. That's all. He'll do whatever the fuck he want to do to you. You're his pet. That's what I'm saying. So you got to understand. Like me, I'm flowing around this bitch how I want. Y'all remember how Neo was in the end of the movie? Swirling through the motherfucking sky, nigga. That's how I'm moving through the Matrix. I'm good. Because I'm on God's side. The sun is shining hard in my life. Real shit. It's good. Everything is good. I'm, I'm not really... I can't complain. That's what I'm trying to tell y'all. Because if y'all follow what the fuck God tell you to do, you'll end up in a better predicament. But y'all don't like to follow him because y'all don't know how to believe in shit. Because y'all can't see him. So the word no and new is just alike. Do you get it? I bet you you can't. I bet you y'all can't solve that fucking riddle. No and new is the same fucking word. It's the same word. That's what I'm saying. Because y'all fucking small minded. So like I said, if y'all want to understand what's going on in life, just just. Understand where I'm coming from when I say this. Get out the fucking programs that you're in. Real shit. Get out of them. Get out of them. Because when you finally do get out of them, man, you're going to be hurting. You're going to be hurting bad. You're going to be like, damn, man, I wish I would have knew all this shit sooner. But like I said, there's people like God. I, I did. I know I did something good. For God, a, a, a few times. I mean, I've been doing stuff good for God my whole life. That's what I'm saying. See, me, I believe in God as far as back as I can remember. Like God could be like, He could say whatever He want. That's why y'all gotta start to remember all this shit is fake. So. Before you start to attach yourself to shit, don't play with yourself. Don't don't hurt yourself. I don't attach myself to nothing. Like I told you, we men, 
we could be like Dr. Sabi, go to an island and pop out another kid, nigga. That's not what I want to do because you get it? I'm already spiritually aligned. Once you spiritually align, everything in your life is going to start to just magnetize and come together. You're just going to find people who want to do what you want to do all the time. So, like I said, those people that fly planes in the buildings and shit like that, yeah, suicide bombers. They know where they going after this. That's the that's the difference between the U.S. Army and the Japanese niggas and the Korean niggas when they was fighting. Do you get it? Them niggas that was flying them planes into them motherfucking niggas was suicide bombers knew where they was going after they died. They knew, all right, once this shit over, I know where I'm going. That's it. That's the whole key. Life is knowing. Y'all could call, like I said, the devil was an angel. So y'all could call me all types of demons if y'all want, because y'all thinking I'm coming here and I'm speaking for God. Yeah, I'm speaking for him. But only those people who smart is really going to listen. Like, I'm not on here to make this a fun thing or get a bunch of subscribers. No, I don't give a fuck what amount of views shit get. Long as I put it there for you to find, it could be 10 years from now when you find it. But this shit going to be here. It's going to be here. I could bring y'all a video anytime I want. So like I said, seeing the light is a demonic program. And any type of seeing that you're doing, if it's not at the actual afterlife, then you seeing you seeing that light is basically consciousness of lostness. That's what you're looking at. When you see that light, you are seeing the world. You about to wake up and <gasps> take your first breath in. That's what that light was. You saw it plenty of times. 